I think it's clear uh, from today's uh, testimony uh, that President Bush must deploy the Strategic Petroleum Reserve uh, in order to send a signal to OPEC that we are going to stop begging, uh, to send a signal to the speculators um, that we are going to begin to take action uh, against them, uh, and to send a signal uh, to um, those who are uh, afraid of the impact on the trucking industry, on the food industry, on the airline industry, and all other industries of this dramatic rise in the price of, of uh, fuel, uh, that we are not going to allow a competition um, uh, here to uh, raise the price of oil to have such a dramatic impact uh, upon our economy. Uh, poor people have to choose between fuel and food. This is not something that America should allow to happen. This is not something that President Bush should sit on the sidelines and pretend he is powerless to do something about. If President Bush can call up the reserves over and over again to go to Iraq, he can deploy the Strategic Petroleum Reserve as a weapon uh, against OPEC and big oil to protect the American consumer and American industry here at home. I think that's clear from the testimony that we heard here today. We thank all of our witnesses uh, for this testimony, and we hope that uh, President Bush hears the plea of the American people. This hearing is adjourned.